Let's Here do it a is. two in one. Uh, Curtis is not messing around today. This is such <laughs> an incredible piece, and it's, it's been a while since we were able to get it back in stock. We call it a two in one, but it's way more than that. It is a grill pan, it is a deep roaster, and then of course when you put them together, it's this incredible sort of Dutch oven um, or, or, or uh, uh, pot roaster, right? The I other thing that. that you're taking home, and sorry, I'll stop doing your job for you. No, and you're, I'll, you're I'll, doing I'll great. Quiet. But the third piece is this beautiful oh, yeah. rack. So you can drop that in, it means that it's a steamer, it also means that it's an incredible roaster with rack. So um, so there you go, that's what All we're right. doing. And this, this is like serious cookware. This is cast aluminum, right? right. Yep. So tell us how this can so work So you're, in the you're probably looking at this and thinking that looks like a cast iron piece, right? And it's true. It looks like cast iron, it cooks like cast iron, but it doesn't weigh what cast iron weighs. Look, I can literally hang that up off my pinky, my, my old trick, and uh, it certainly doesn't cost what cast iron costs, right? It's beautiful, it is Durapan, so it is that non-stick that you know and love. Have a look at the caramelization you're able to get on it though. We make it the exact same way you make cast iron, in fact. You heat up the aluminum okay. and then you pour it into a cast. That's why it's called cast iron, into a mold. Um, and then basically what happens is you let it set. It's a more expensive and a slightly slower production, but the quality uh, is just second to none. Have a look how these eggs are sliding out of the pan, right? Now this is Whoa. the grill pan, mind you. So when I go ahead and I wipe that clean, because that's all you'll be doing is wiping any of that oil or grease out, right? Let me show you what the eggs look like on the underside though. Because when I lift this up, do you see that? Mm -hmm. See how you're getting that caramelization, that beautiful grill mark on the bottom there um, of the egg. So you'll be able to cook for the whole tribe really simply. Isn't that cool? And that's not a separate pan. That grill pan is the lid. Here's the grill pan, here's the lid. It's like a two in one. You can use that as the lid on your roaster or you can flip it off and you can use it on the stovetop mm -hmm. or you can use them in the oven. And we've got lots of great collars for you to choose from in our eight and a half quart roaster. It's a big, big customer pick with over 260 rave reviews. Uh, and there's the colors right over there. We've got the deep blue, which is like that denim blue, that lapis blue. We've got the popular turquoise. We have the that. red I and I think we, have the, is it just turquoise, blue, and red? Okay, turquoise, blue, and red. Here's the deal. We do have the sale price for you today and five flexible payments. Five flex pays. That's on everything today, on air, online, with Curtis Stone. So you can add it to your purchase of your today's special. And then talk about cooking for a crowd. Oh, yeah. So, look, I mean, here's the beautiful thing about this pan. This is a roaster. It's a slow cooker. It's a steamer. So that screams fall, winter, spring. You'll yeah. be doing that all year long, right? This, you guys, is the most incredible grill pan. So when that weather is not cooperating... By the way, I saw a, a news report yesterday saying bad weather is coming and it's coming all week long, right? And it's all over the country. Sometimes it surprises us. Here we are in May and we think we're going to get sunshine. Sometimes you've got that grill planned outdoors and then the weather turns on you. Well, now you can take the grill inside. You're still getting that incredible flavor of the grill because you're getting all of that caramelization that delicious char that you're seeing on that beautiful steak look at that um, and then you you know you, you're not uh, you're not dealing with the elements uh, don't get me wrong I love grilling I love being outside but I also <laughs> I want to do it all year round and now you can so here's the deal we've just made a mess of this grill pan watch this I literally wipe across those grill grates and then that just lifts straight on off why because it's the Durapan technology you know, you, we've done this now for about five or six years. It is just the most beautiful cookware. We've sold 1.7 mm -hmm. million pieces of this cookware. Yeah, you people will absolutely love, love it. Love Durapan. And who else loves Durapan? It's Kathleen in California. Loves Durapan. Kathleen, you're live with Sarah and Curtis Stone. Hi, happy Saturday. Hey, Kathleen. Hi. How you doing? Yes, I'm calling. I absolutely love your Durapan. Isn't it? Why, darling? Hey. Tell us why. Mostly the cleanup, but the way that they brown. I purchased your CD after watching you demo it one night. Yeah. And I just, I, I've tried it with every other pan, and a lot of times you get sticking. Right. You know, the copper pans or the uh -huh. non-stick. And yep. I use the dirt pans in combination with your CD, oh, yeah. and it is just the best combo ever. 
because I get all the grill marks after I've after I've cooked it to a perfect temperature. Yep. And I just love your products. Thank you, Thank Kathleen. Thank you so much, Kathleen. Now, Kathleen, one thing I stand behind is the even and fast heating. Right now, if I show you this, it's kind of unbelievable, so I'm gonna do it. But have a look underneath this pan. See how I've got two round burners? You would think that those two round burners would give me two hot spots, right? Well, watch what happens. Right. I've just put this pan on. First of all, look how quickly it comes to the boil, and look how evenly it comes to the boil. You can't see two round patterns there, can you? You know why? Because no. of the aluminum. The reason that happens is because that aluminum distributes that heat so beautifully and so evenly. So I can now go ahead and steam my fish. If I wanted to put mussels and clams in there as well, I could. Um, do we have the lid there, Rochelle? Oh, thank you so much. Here's um, I've got some, uh, some greens here, Kathleen. I'm gonna stick some bok choy, maybe a little carrot that can come out of my pinch bowl. Fantastic. And then I've got a little chili. I mean, the capacity's really amazing. By the way, thank you so much for your call, Kathleen. Yeah, thanks, Kathleen. How nice to hear from you. Uh, you can put like up to a 16 pound turkey in here, right? You sure can. You can cook turkey, you can do chicken, you can roast beef. There's just so many options. And then of course, the grill lid, turns over and creates the most divine yeah. lid. That's amazing. It and really could you is. put, again, you can put this in the oven. Oh yeah, we can. Up we to sure can. 400 up to 450 degrees. 450 degrees. 450 yep. degrees. All the way up there. Wow, it's a serious pan. And we do have three collars. We do have the sealed price. And we do have those interest-free monthly payments to make this really easy for you. And also, this is coming on free shipping. And not all cookware comes on free shipping every day. This one does. So it's the perfect time to get it home. You never have to make a final decision. We've got 30-day returns here at HSN. Uh, easy returns. And with the flexible payments, you, you know, put down one payment, and we ship it to you right away. So you get to enjoy it now and pay for it later. If you've been thinking about adding a roaster or something mm -hmm. that can do a stock pot, Dutch oven type job in the kitchen, right. it's never been a perfect time. A quick update, we have about 430 of the turquoise and then the red will be right behind it for a sellout. We also have the deep blue. Right. Oh, so that's about to sell. Okay, yeah. so let me show you another thing that I just love about this. Look, this water's just coming up to the boil, but look at this. I've got a full box of spaghetti here in my hand. You know how spaghetti, when you stick it in a round pan, it usually gotta... kind of melts and it doesn't work very well? Well, here, I can just go ahead, lay it in. You know, none of your fettuccine, your tagliatelle, your spaghetti is ever going to stick because it all gets all that beautiful length mm -hmm. to, uh, to, to melt and start to cook, right? So whether you're cooking pasta or whether you're doing using it as a deep fryer, again, funnel cakes are brilliant. I'm actually going to do churros here. So Ooh, I go what ahead. What a great idea for I, fiesta. Isn't it? Yeah, we did that little Mexican feast earlier. So we're going to go ahead and pipe those in. You want them nice and long. Are easy to make? Really easy. The batter really? is super simple. Um, and then you just stick it into a little piping bag. And then as long as you've got the capacity to be able to fry, uh, you can just drop it all in and it mm -hmm. comes to fry in straight away. Really, really simple. They work on all stove tops? All stove tops. We've got the, the stainless steel plate on the mm -hmm. bottom, which makes it induction friendly. I'm running over here to the oven because I want I want you to see how you can use it as a roaster too. Oh. So we've done a whole turkey breast there with the vegetables around. So because of those grill grates, you can see it's actually raised up. So that turkey, let me flip it over and show it to you. See, you've got that gorgeous caramelization. It's not frying. It's actually it's actually grilling yeah. while it roasts. So it's a Isn't really- Isn't that nice? And it's not sitting in its own juices. Exactly, So, so the exactly. grease and the oils kind of naturally drain away. And that means everything stays crunchy and crispy. And you get the tenderness that you want from your meat, which is on the inside. Think about all the great ways you're gonna use this. this is gonna this will be like, you'll get it home and you'll probably have even more ideas. Uh, and how about burgers? I mean, if you just want to do a classic burger night. Well, let's do something silly. I put the burgers in there, <laughs> and now I keep saying that, don't I? Now I'll put the cheese on top. Let's do something like this. Let's go ahead and flip those burgers cheese side down uh -oh. and see what happens, right? What's <laughs> going to happen? I know how silly this looks, <laughs> but nothing's going to stick. So okay. that cheese is actually just going to get crisp, and then we're going to mm. flip it back over, and away we go. I've just pulled this one, which we were using as a Dutch oven here, out out of the, out of the uh, stove, out of the oven rather. So let me take the lid off. Mm -hmm. You can see this beautiful big piece of beef. Wow. Look at this. And I'm just using my tiger bamboo tongs if, you, if you're in the market for a pair of tongs. Look at how that beef is just pulling apart. 
Uh, oh. It's just so delicious, so wonderful. This is a big old piece of brisket. And have a look at that, how simple and easy it is wow, to slow cook. that be cook. amazing? And, right. and how, how much healthier is it to cook at home versus, oh, you know, absolutely. driving through a fast food restaurant? Well, I imagine pulled pork, the, this beautiful brisket that we're cooking here. There's just so many different easy ways to cook. You know, I'm doing a big amazing. batch, and that's what I love Tacos, about this. Tacos, sandwiches. Yeah, bolognese sauce I'm going to make right uh -huh. here. So I've got my beef that I've browned really, really nicely. Don't forget about the chopper mash, you guys. The chopper on this side, the masher on this side. I'm going to go through it one more time and just make sure that I'm browning that beef really evenly. So you give that one last that's, chop. That's a great idea because, you know, with a fork, you're trying to get in there and the fork doesn't lie flat when you're chopping from the top. Right, exactly. Um, that's what we love about Curtis Stone because it's the most innovative and user-friendly ideas. You don't have to be a professional you don't. to use you your know, cookware. No, absolutely not. I mean, have a look at the capacity here. That was eight cups of marinara sauce, right? Yeah. Then I'm going to... This is what, where the spurtle really comes into its own. It's a great stirrer, but it also gets all around the edges there and makes sure there's nothing sticking um, to the edges. Not that anything sticks to the durapan, but, you know, the spurtle is really such a good, sturdy, strong tool. You know, and I just never even thought to think that you could put such a big pan on a smaller burner. Right. Oh, yeah. Well, but that's why we do it with the aluminum. You can go ahead and take over the whole stove, but you've got eight and a half quarts, so yep. if you can make a serious stew, bolognese sauce, maybe you're grilling burgers one night and making a pot roast the next. And what here a we go. Solution. Here we go with the fish. So we actually remember the fish that we steamed before. Yeah. Uh, we we put that in. So let me take those beautiful uh, grilled pieces off. Mm -hmm. Bring this up the front here. So that's on the rack. So of course, when it's time to actually serve that, you're just going to go ahead pick up that rack and the whole thing will lift out just like that. Um, so, you know, you're able to do so many different mm -hmm. things so, so simply. In fact, I'm going to go over to this this one. I think it's the only one that's not hot. <laughs> I'm going to show you how lightweight they are. Now you're thinking, it looks like cast iron. It cooks like cast iron. This does not feel like cast iron. I mean, Curtis Stone is a big guy, but let me tell you, I can even hold these up. And the fact that it's a two-in-one, that it has the grilling on the lid, this becomes your grill pan. How many times each summer do you want to go outside and grill, but there's a sudden downpour or suddenly you've run out of oil or gas for one of your outdoor grills? This is the easiest way to get a really nice grill mark, really great searing, really great juicy steaks and burgers inside and out. And then that grill pan turns into a lid. It's induction safe. It's great for all stovetops. Oven safe up to 450 degrees. And we've got three great colors left. So jump right in. These are almost gone. The turquoise, the red, or we have that beautiful deep blue which is like the color of lapis which uh, by the way if you love lapis stay tuned next hour jay king and i'll be back with turquoise and lapis uh jewelry that you can wear and this is jewelry for your kitchen we've got sure a couple is. more mentions for you yeah so i've just taken those cheeseburgers out i want to show you one last mm -hmm. time this cleanup and then our hour has come to an end i'm just going to let you know some of those today special colors you guys they will be gone later on yeah. today so if you want a you particular color make sure you go ahead and get it while you can but look at that clean up jump Spotless. in on that two in one roaster and grill pan the one and a half quart saucepan this was that little saucepan i was holding up earlier it comes with